Hi, this is Faye Heidi, your Lutz Solar Systems Customer Service Representative. Today we're going to talk about double stacking your LS60 Pressure Tune Telescope with the LS50 filter. Here's the LS50 FHA filter. We've already removed the lens covers to get it ready to attach. This system utilizes a tilt wheel to bring it onto band. This little wheel has a lot of travel, so if you have one of these, don't be afraid to turn it all the way in either direction. You can't break it. Okay, here we have our LS60 Pressure Tune Telescope. And before you attach the 50, you'll want to get it to your best tuning possible with the sharpest disc image. You'll also want to get it nice and focused. Okay, you'll find attaching your double stack filter is very simple. It'll actually thread right onto the front objective of your LS60. We like to keep this in mind for our customers so that you can add on to a later time, making it a very customizable system. Okay, now we'll add our LS50 to the front of our 60. Just like with our pressure tuning, we do recommend doing a slight counterspin to find the threads, and then you start putting it on there. You want to make sure that this is tightened firmly down to avoid any possible damage. Now you're ready to double stack. At this point, you will have tuned your 60 to a very likable point for your viewing, and then you'll want to engage the double stack to enhance the detail that you're seeing. You do this by engaging the tilt wheel. Now you have successfully double stacked your LS60 pressure tune telescope with the LS50 front filter. If you'd like a preview before you buy, go to our website, luntsolarsystems.com. If you scroll halfway down on our homepage, you'll find an area called What You'll See. If you'd like instructions on mounting your LS60, check out our other YouTube videos for help with that. Thanks for watching today.